to Governor Christy Nome from Columnist with Trusty Spreadsheet Life must be good in South Dakota because I saw you had enough free time to post on Facebook a picture of a car with this message on its rear glass, escaped communism. Returned home to freedom. California sucks. And you commented, today at Mount Rushmore. Another freedom lover rescued from California. Welcome to South Dakota. Her post drew 17,000 comments many of which called out Gnome for being immature, embarrassing and divisive. Let me know when you figure out the irony of posting this on Facebook using an iPhone, commented Lee Fink. The companies that make the popular device and created the social media titan are based right here in California. Like any state, California isn't perfect and isn't for everybody. And as I recently did for another California-phobic Republican governor, Doug Ducey of Arizona, here's help understanding my state's economic success with some data-based food for thought. You might consider applying California's communism to your state after reviewing this list. People. I view population as a measure of popularity, and in this case, it paints your state poorly. South Dakota's 887,000 residents are approximately the same size as our Kern County. By the way, 10 California counties have even more people. Movers. Since your post highlighted migration trends, I'll note that your state lost an average of 3. 3% of its population annually to other states in the past decade. Only nine states fared worse. Oh, California lost only one. Six percent of its people annually, half your exit rate and the nation's lowest exit rate. What exodus? Costs. Yes, California is expensive. Our cost of living is 32% higher than your state and our homes cost triple what South Dakotans pay. But you get what you pay for, right? California's household incomes also are 30% above your state. Taxes. South Dakota has no income tax, and California has high tax rates. But when the Tax Foundation studied all state and local tax burdens, your state's 9. 1% rate was only 14th best versus. California's 11. 5%, 8th highest. Apparently, 39 million folks here think the extra 2. 4% is worth it. Handouts? How did South Dakota pay its bills with fewer tax dollars? Perhaps it's the $5, 6 billion more it took in from the federal government than its citizens paid out in taxes from 2015 through 2019, according to the Rockefeller Institute of Government. You should be thanking Californians, who paid $43 billion more to Uncle Sam than they got in return. Jobs. Your statewide workforce of 434,000 would make South Dakota the no. 11 job market in California, ranked between San Mateo and Contra Costa counties. Before the pandemic started, South Dakota had boosted jobs by 18% this century, trailing California's 23% growth. Jobless? Congratulations on one of the swiftest economic rebounds of the pandemic era. South Dakota's 2. 8% unemployment rate for May was bettered by only New Hampshire, Vermont, Nebraska, and Utah.